Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum dear fellows. In this video, I'm going to uh, teach you uh, the uh, different uh, sizes of the birds. It's not about the sizes. Basically, it's uh, depend on the bloom of the bird. The basic bird, uh, which is ready to bloom, is always in gr in green color. So uh, let's start making the basic bird. First of all, I'm using the cone shaped knife. You can see the knife is. A is very pointed from the tip and uh, broad from the base so add the paste and make you can see this is the shape of the bird it's the perfect shape of the bird but it's a, it's the it is flat so we are going to add the paste to it to give it a height first secondly I will use this half cut it petals or D shape uh, technique which we use for the sepals just put the sepal or this half shape over here and fold it like this I made this D shape petal from the the right side now I am using the left side D shape so this is the left one I have to make it from the right now like this lift it and put it on the butt like this you can see you get perfect overlapped bud like this you can shape the bud with the wet brush you can smoothen the edges cut the bottom and make a ball to make the lower part of the bud and the stem like this this is the first bud but you can also see the basic bud so I think you understand how I made this bud the second bud is slightly bloomed bud so for this you need a color but uh, color paste of the any color you want to make uh, you want to use the rose with it so you just take the knife clean from the both side press the knife and get the first shape of the first uh, petal of the bud now the, it's time to use green color because it will be slightly visible the, this pink color will be slightly visible because it's not fully bloomed now take the paste from the right side like this and cut it out and take the paste from the take out the paste from the right side of the knife so you can get two D's like this Clean the knife, also your fingers. Let me zoom it out, zoom it in for you so you can easily see how I made the bud. Lift this side and place it over here. So the round part should be inside of the bud, and the flat side should be the at the base side and now lift the other petal I think I have to make it again Like 
this lift the paste and put it over here you can use wet brush to give it a shape or knife anything which you feel easy for you this lower part is invisible the, you cannot see the red part so open the tip of the bud so it will be visible and just close this area make a ball and attach to the bottom this is the second little bit bloomed bird the third bird will be made with the color paste so you need a little bit color paste here clean the surface make sure your surface is will would be clean okay now use the paste like this if you feel your paste is getting dry add a little bit glue or the wet paste just put the paste exactly on the back side of the knife clean the both edges and put it here like this you need to shape the pattern it's better to make these birds on any other on the plastic sheet or on tile where you can easily lift the petal you can also make the petals on the board there is no big issue board on the canvas on which you are going to make your project so i have made two days right day and left day so i'm going to lift my right day and this flat surface should be on the on the right side where the petal touches the tile and the this flat surface of the left petal should be at this area where it can touch the bud this is how you can make bud now it's time to make the sepals clean the area because it's pink take the green color and make the sepals whenever you make the sepal you need to take the paste from one side and cut it don't make too thick sepals make sure that the size of the sepal should be bigger than your rose but my size is smaller so i am going to use a little bit bigger knife check this is the knife with which i made the bird and this is the knife with which i'm going to make the sepal just take the sepal make sure that you're full you can uh, you get full coverage of the knife so you can get a bigger sepal one two and the third one this is the third one now clean the knife with the wet cloth and lift the sepal make sure your fingers are clean because here we are going to give the shape to the shape to the sepal just pinch lift the uh, sepal pinch the edge to make it a long one and now place the sepal on the bed like this be careful don't spoil its uh, the shape of it now again lift the sepal 
shape it you can also give it a twist to it and put it over here and the third one press the edge give it a nice thin edge you can also turn it and place it on here in the right side just make sure your circles are attached to the bud now make the ball of the bud just use your palm and your finger attach the bud and shape it you can shape the bud um, while you after you're putting this bird on this on the board or the on the canvas as well okay these are the three birds which i have made uh, this is uh, just slightly bloom bird now i'm going to teach you how to make half bloom bird after these birds uh, the next uh, lesson will be the lesson of uh, the roses or the sidewise small roses and the big roses which i have already taught you so many times so this is this was the main uh, uh, lesson uh, which you need to learn because the birds are much as uh, equal important as the rose has so bird making is very much important to know how to make the bird because this is the basic lesson i made the first petal basic petal left d right d you need to need the petal every time okay now add these petals make sure this straight line touches the base like this now i'm going to add one more petal on the top of it or you can add another petal on the side in this side like this make sure the straight line will touches the edge or starting edge of the petal of the bird sorry this is how i made the little bit bigger size bird by keep on adding the petals now i'm going to add the top petal lift the petal and place it on the bird this is a little bit bigger petal than the previous one Let's add another petal on this side this is how you can make little bit bigger size petals bigger size bird sorry i think it's enough now it's time to make the sapo clean the knife also the platform take the green color if you think your color got dry add some glue to smoothen it and to soften it and now i'm going to use little bit bigger size of knife which i have already used in the previous part add the paste and make at least three sepals with it i hope my paste is enough to make this sepal which i don't think so 
let's see. Now lift the petal, circle here, from here and add it on the one side of the butt like this. Then next shape it and add it two and the third one Just give it a shape and the last one here like this make a ball of the green paste over here this is how I have I prepare my birds now lift the birds and place the area where you want to attach them this is the very important lesson of the bird making i have to show three blooms of the birds so it might help you making birds easily thank you